Hey everyone, this is my Arduino based computer as you can see right here. It's running on an Arduino Uno Revision 3, it's a real, I mean, original Arduino Uno from Italy. So, this is a Nokia 5110 LCD screen. I bought it from Amazon and I bought this too from Amazon and I bought it from a local shop, right? This button from a local shop. So, that's pretty much it with the hardware. I'm controlling the menu using this button. I'm going I'm planning to extend the menu with this button too. The secondary button right here. So this will be used for selecting the option on the menu. And let me show you how it works. Right now it's connected directly to my laptop right here. As you can see. The serial monitor is used for confirming the input. So I will explain to you later on so now let me plug this in as you can see i'm using the usb for powering this let me plug this in i have plugged this in so now let me restart the serial monitor okay now i have a new serial monitor window open on my laptop so here as you can see on the device the menu has appeared so now let me turn on the backlight it's in the settings so settings is the second option click it twice and now to confirm the input you have to type in 7 on the serial monitor later on I will be changing that to this button just like an ok button or something so for now I have to input 7 on the serial monitor let me let me go here and input 7 7 and then press enter so as you can see here there's the option for turning on backlight turning on backlight now let me press 1 1 and then input 7 again okay now the wire is a bit loose okay fine so now let me go back now I'm back at the menu at the home page home screen so let me show you the about screen here about is the third option one two three so here is it version 6 version 0 0.6 beta version so I'm going back right now and let me show you the applications one and then seven okay now right now I have two applications that's, uh, that are, that is calculator and a game I haven't really implemented the game yet so the calculator is the only thing that's really really functional right now let me open the calculator one so here it is now you can input the values so for a let me input 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 so 7 okay now let me input the value of b let that be um, 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and now let me enter so now here you have three options add subtract multiply and divide let me multiply the values right now by entering three i mean by entering three right here one two three okay then i'm pressing seven here as you can see here's the output 10 into 8 equals 80 so now let me go back and the fourth option on the home screen is sleep let me show you how sleep works it puts the turn off the display and keeps it in a low power mode so now let me show you what sleep is now it has turned off the display and the backlight and now it's in the low power mode so that it won't consume much battery when it's connected to a battery power source 
so for turning it back on you have to press this nine times one two three four five six seven eight nine and then enter the enter it back again so now it's back up running as you can see it remembered that uh, the backlight was on before so if it was off let me show you Uh, if now if I put it into the sleep mode it goes to sleep and when it turns back on after pressing this button nine times oops I think I missed it so one two three four five six seven eight nine nine times it just comes back like this to the home screen without turning on the backlight so that's pretty much it in this video i'll be updating it i'll be adding more options uh, by uh, removing the need of the computer for the confirmation of inputs so that's pretty much it for this video hope you guys liked it subscribe to my channel for more please leave a like a comment if you have any doubt on this project i'll be really ha happy to help you guys so that's it Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.